right, guys. Um, so I thought I'd give a quick demonstration of the email scraping program I've been working on the last couple of days. Um, it's still in beta, so it's got some bugs to work out, but you can always download the updates as I make changes to it. Um, first things first is the uh, targeted scraper. So if you need to scrape highly targeted emails, uh, this is you know a great tool for that. Uh, so let's say for this uh, demonstration, we'll we want to search for Minecraft emails. Um, emails uh, related to Minecraft. So we can scrape minecraftforum.net for those. Uh, click search. Uh, looks like we got a cap capture right off the bat. That's no problem. We'll clear it up and it'll start right back where it left off. And there it goes. Scraping emails from all the pages of Google. That's, uh, it'll eat through these pretty fast. Um, let it run for a second. So you got all these highly targeted Minecraft emails. Um, you can also do like a keyword search. So if you wanted to find, say you're doing PPD and you have a fake Minecraft hack generator or something, you could type in something like send Minecraft hack. And it'll find any emails related to that. So you got all these people that could be possibly looking for some kind of hack, and now you have their email, you can send it to them. You know, use it for whatever. There's tons of niches, there's tons of keywords that you can use. Um, go ahead and stop this. We also have the option to do uh, fresh only. So what that does is, um, try this real quick, mine. Crap. What that'll do is that'll search uh, Google within the past month, you can see right here. Um, for emails related to Minecraft, so these are all going to be fresh, brand new emails, which is great. You know, you, you know, they have, probably haven't been spammed too hard if they have been at all. Um, so yeah, look at it. We got like a thousand emails in just a minute or two. Uh, you can also use go ahead and th use a proxy with that if you if you really feel the need. I don't really think you need it, but Google may ban your idea if you're really spamming this to death. This isn't really meant for like large amounts of scraping Google. Um, so, uh, I haven't used a proxy yet, and I've been fine. Um, so next, we'll do the site spider. So, say you want to, you have a domain, and you want to scrape the entire domain for emails. Well, what you can do is you can type in the domain. Um, so let's say, schematics, my site. Um, put that in there, and go ahead and what we can do is crawl the website for URLs. So it's working right now, and it's just basically spidering the entire site, finding all the links on it. Um, I leave this as main domain only, but if you want, you can uncheck that. And what that'll do is that it'll find any links on the page at all. So it won't just be the domain you're searching for. It'll be like if there's an external link to like Facebook or something like that, it'll grab all those links as well. Um, but this is the entire site right here. It's just grabbed everything. And then what you can do with this is you can transfer it to uh, a bulk uh, scraper. So what this does is it's uh, multi-threaded. It will go to all these URLs and check them for emails. Now, I, this is my site. I know there's only a couple emails on this entire site. But just for the sake of showing, um, I'll go ahead and start this. And as you can see, it's... Uh, right off the bat finding the emails. Um, now it, there's a bunch of duplicates because you know the same emails are found on the same page but you can actually remove those easily. Uh, I, I hope this tool helps some people out. Um, like I said I'll be updating it as I go along. Thanks guys.